Hey, it's Roger from Practically Outdoors. Sorry, it's Roger from Practically Outdoors, and uh, it's April 2nd, 2020. Uh, we're kind of in the middle of this COVID crisis right now. Uh, I'm not trying to make light of the situation, but uh, in the meantime, uh, since I've had a couple of weeks of the stay home thing, uh, I want to show you what I've been working on. Stay tuned. So this is uh, the, uh, it started out was going to be a snowmobile camper because I had originally built it on skis. So it's set up to uh, ride on skis. And then I built a trailer for it after that and decided I wanted to use it with my, uh, with my ATV. So it is now my ATV slash sled trailer. And uh, give you a look inside here. This is uh, pretty much the layout. I've got kind of a storage area here where I keep my batteries. And I've got a battery in here. I've got uh, just some general storage, a little, uh, little converter, basically my bunk for the evening, and a place, place for the big screen TV little shelf for some stuff a couple of lights there's one on that side there as well I'll brighten it up and that's uh, fully insulated it's got an inch and a half foam insulation everywhere inside including the ceiling and the floor and uh, covered that with uh, just this camel cloth basically a ground blind camel cloth that you can get at your local stores uh, made out of plywood OSB in the front. It's got a 40 watt solar panel. And in the back of the trailer, it's eight feet long. The reason I built it was to get eight feet, one sheet of plywood on the whole side of it, and one sheet of plywood for the floor. And it gave me a four by eight foot wide. So it's four feet wide, eight feet long in the back. is my kitchen another little led light up there for storage so uh got my my little camp stove place to secure some bottles of propane pots pans basically a food pack and, and uh, some dishes stuff like that and uh, added some struts from my local Princess Auto store. So this is what you do when you're locked down uh, for a couple of weeks and you got nothing better to do. You dream of ways of finding, finding how to get out into the bush. So yeah, that's what I've been working on. Hopefully I'll update this video uh, when I've got it out in the bush and I'm using it again.